long bio hair or short bio hair? Let's talk about it. Still there. Welcome to the channel guys. Welcome to the hair experience. I am Curtis, your guide to get hair back on your head when things are normal <laughs> and there's no coronavirus affecting supplies and supply chains and things like that. I'll be your guide. Um, hair by MHE.com has got all the supplies. Um, I would say hair units, but most are out of stock. So we're eight to 16 weeks delayed on most of those products. Uh, but all supplies are in stock, guys. All the starter kits are in stock. All of the bonds are in stock. You know, adhesives, shampoos, everything, all that's in stock. Uh, my hair experience has got a lot of the information, FAQs. Guys, read those FAQs, get the book. Um, they're half price right now, so I I'm not trying to push you to do it. I just want knowledge is power, guys. Knowledge is key. Um, also want to get on just a little bit of information here. Um, be careful what you get right now. Um, we we've seen a lot of companies, and I'm not talking U.S. retailers. I'm talking Chinese wholesalers trying to peddle products that are... <laughs> They're not the best. So um, just be careful what you get right now. I understand people are in a have to situation and you have to. So j just be careful what you get right now. Um, that's all I got for that. Hopefully things are back to normal soon. I'm ready for normal. It makes you miss normal. Anyways, I want to talk about longer biological hair or shorter biological hair. What works best? Guys, you know my opinion on longer hair. I like it. But I did a poll with you guys and a poll with my wife. <laughs> and 78% of you guys said shorter hair. And Amanda said, cut that crap off. Um, but for some reason, I've always liked longer hair. You can do it. The point of the story is you can do it either way, okay? Either way, either way, whatever you want to call it. You can do it either way. I have done it both ways. Um... It's all about your stylist, guys. It's all about your stylist and how well they can cut hair. Not that they have to be a specialist when it comes to uh, hair replacement, they don't. It's just how well they can do their job. Um, makes it whether or not if you're going to have a good haircut or a bad haircut with long biological hair or short biological hair. It doesn't matter. What does matter if you're going to to be you doing a shorter hairstyle, you can go all the way up to a um, what do you call that? A uh, undercut. There has to be no skill there at all. It's an undercut. It goes up to where the unit starts. It's short, and then the top is long. That's kind of a, a, a younger haircut, I would call it. Somebody past forty, probably not something that's going to be pulled off well, unless you're um, kind of a faddish kind of person like me. I like cool different things when fads happen um so i'll try them or not try them whatever i just like when things are cool um uh kind of hip you know what i mean like hipster kind of haircut it's kind of cool um but you know if you're a business person you know you wear a suit all day i mean i guess you could wear your hair however the heck you want to but you see my point um when you're doing a shorter biological haircut you are going to want to keep the the biological hair up around where the unit is about an inch longer so it blends and flows in with the unit well then you can do a fade at the bottom depending on how good your biological hair is is how well it will blend or how how short you can cut it like my biological hair on the sides and the back is not super thick so I can't do a skin fade. I did want to try it. It was the thing six months ago, I guess. I did want to try it, but I just didn't do it um, because my biological hair wouldn't allow me to do it. So those are things that you have to pay attention to, whether or not if you're gonna choose longer hair or shorter hair. Really talk to a professional, a stylist, it doesn't have to be a hair replacement professional, just a stylist or a barber, and say, hey, can I do a skin fade? Can I do a number two fade? Can I do this or that? What's gonna be best for me? And let them help you through that process, okay? That's with shorter hair, all right? 
Now with longer hair. Longer hair comes with its own set of issues. Um, and it's not unit related, it's not hair system related. It will blend easily into the unit hair from the biological hair to the unit hair, um, just as long as they're tapered and, and, put, and put together correctly with a good stylist, yet again, a good stylist. That means everything. Um, with longer hair comes more issues of, like me, I got these, I don't know what side it is, but one, they wanna, like I'm growing my hair out again, um, I, it's not gonna be there for long. <laughs> I don't think it's annoying me already. But it comes with this little flippy stuff, or it could be like it, it goes straight, um, or it's flippy on one side and not on the other, kind of like mine does, all like just not cool <laughs> at all. Um, so that comes with its own set of things. You're having to take care of your biological hair too. Hair care is a big deal. You know, if you like, if I use my straightener to try to straighten these curls out, I walk outside and it's super humid, gone. They're curled again and, and I just wasted all my time. So you guys see the point here. If you put a lot of heavy conditioners in, it's gonna weigh the hair down. It's gonna look greasy, gonna look matty or matted. Um, so each one has its set of, of things that you're gonna have to deal with. But what's better, there is no better. What's better is what's better for you. What blends with you? Guys, I get hundreds of pictures probably a month from our clients that show me how their hair is cut and they look phenomenal. Long hair, short hair, doesn't matter. I've done them both. Both are doable, totally doable. Um, now, when I say longer hair, you're going to, like if you get a stock unit, you know, six inches, you're gonna wanna cut that last half inch off um, just so things are smooth. Um, and, and then whenever they start taping, tapering and blending, you're going to get some length cut out because of that too. So there's only so long you can go with biological hair when you use a stock unit. Anything past, I don't even know where it would be. I haven't grown my hair that long. So um, at some point you'll have to go into a custom unit to get longer hair. So that's what I got guys. Both are possible. You can do either or. It doesn't matter. Um, just as long as the stylist can cut your hair, you're going to be good to go. That's what I got today, guys. I hope that information is helpful. Hit that subscribe button. Hit that like button if you do like my content and it's helpful. And uh, we'll see you in a couple of days. Have a great weekend.